Hey, so what's going on? My name is Luis, and God bless every single one of you. Today is December 7, 2023, and welcome to the Grand Supreme News Channel. All right, guys, so we have some urgent information coming out. If you can, please share this video. And it says here, tens of thousands of fish are washing up dead along the coast of northern Japan. Very concerning information. If you can, please share this video. And I remember back in August, give me a second here. Let me just bring this up really quick. Back in August, you guys remember this, tons of radioactive waste was released into the Pacific Ocean. And that sounded the alarm for many people around the world. Even the Red Dragon, C-H-I-N-A, they said they would no longer buy seafood from Japan. So uh, Japan came out and said, hey, nothing to worry about, everything is well. Uh, we have a fish right here, we're gonna eat it in front of you guys live on television. So, you know, they cut the fish and everything, they cooked it, whatever, and they ate it in front of everyone. And it seemed like that fish was really delicious. It looked like it came from Antarctica instead of the Pacific. <laughs> so, but um, yeah, it seems like we are seeing the aftermath. Thousands upon thousands of dead fish uh, right now is being uh, reported out there in northern Japan. So uh, we're going to see what's going on here, guys. We have tons of information. And it's very important that people uh, start prepping spiritually, physically, and mentally. Once again, um, anything that is dumped into the Pacific Ocean by Japan, I mean, we're talking about radioactive. When they say the fish is good, yeah, mm, sorry. But uh, you guys dump a whole bunch of stuff there. And here's the result. All right, guys, before I start, give this video a big thumbs up. Share this video with your friends, family, some loved ones. I appreciate the love and support. And for those of you that want to contribute to the channel, once again, the PayPal link and the Patreon link is in the description box. Also, guys, $1 a month Patreon. We get your access to our live stream every Sunday. We talk about things that we cannot talk about on the platform. Also, I posted videos today. Those link will be in the comments box. And for those of you that want to send us letters or prayer requests, you can send it to me, Luis Santiago, at 3432 US Highway 19, number 2, Holiday, Florida, 34. 4691. All right, guys, let me go with this one first. All right, let me just uh, give you a little bit of this information. I know a lot of people probably forgot about this story here, but uh, this is how it started. All right, so this week, again, going back to August 2023, this week, Japan will begin releasing more than a million tons of treated radioactive water now stored at the Disabled Fukushima, you know what, nuclear power plant into the Pacific Ocean. That was back in August. December, thousands of those fish are popping up left and right. It is expected to take decades to release all of the water at the plant, which was devastated in 2011 by a tsunami generated by the powerful uh, Tohoku Earthquake, Tokyo Electric Power Company, or TEPCO, which operates the facility and the International Atomic Energy Agency, both says the radiation to be released will be of such low concentration that it will have a negligible uh, radio logical impact on people and the environment. That may turn out to be true. If everything goes according to TEPCO's plans const uh, constantly uh, and without major mishap for at least the next 30 years, only time will tell. Only time will tell. Only time will tell. Well, it took, uh, again, four months to see that result. And here we go, ladies and gentlemen, from August all the way to December, we are seeing the tip of the iceberg. All right, let's go with this one here. All right, so this information is coming out today. Japan uh, says thousands of dead fish wash up 
on beach and island countries' northern region. Thousands of dead fish were seen washing ashore along the northern coast of Japan. A video showing the lifeless fish being washed onto the shore as surface on X. Once again, thousands of dead fish mysteriously, mysteriously. <laughs> oh man, um, mysteriously. That ain't no mystery, <laughs> man. Oh man, um, thousands of fish. Uh, thousands of dead fish mysteriously washed up along the coast of northern Japan. A video sh uh, showing the lifeless fish being washed onto the shore has surfaced on X, formerly Twitter. Now, people on social media platform has reacted to the viral video. Uh, something fishy is going on, wrote one user. Another raised concerns and said, if the phenomenon had anything to do with the nuclear waste, nuclear waste, nuclear waste, thank you. Someone is coming out with some positive stuff. Nuclear waste dumped in the ocean, while another deemed it as a sign of an earthquake. There's a possibility. Maybe the earthquake that struck uh, Philippines last week this uh it was almost an 8.0 magnitude that thing was powerful and then the aftershock there was so many aftershocks strong ones too there's a possibility uh methane gas might have uh, popped up or something but it wouldn't be in japan only it'd be in multiple regions but i do believe that this is um the events that happened back in august that they released a whole bunch of radioactive stuff so the real cause of the fish event remains unknown. Mm-hmm. Yeah, sure. All right, so the sleeping giant shocker. Thousands of dead fish washed up on a beach in Texas. Low oxygen taking fishes claim experts. What? I'm going to have to click on that one there. I was not aware of Texas seeing that event too. Give me a second here. I want to click on this one. All right, give me a second. We're going to see what's going on with this article. All right, so it says here, once again, please share this video. A massive number of dead fish have been discovered washing up on the shores of northern Japan, captured in a viral video. We already know this, Skip. In a similar incident in Japan, frozen sardines were observed washing ashore on the beaches of three towns in this region in January. Their, their bodies uh, spanning several kilometers along the sea of these regions. The phenomenon occurred last year and also five years ago near the city of Wakan, I'm gonna skip that name, uh, following a powerful snowstorm. Their specific cause of this event remains a mystery. Mm -hmm. Yeah, call it mystery, call it mystery. It just, uh, again, it's just a cover up for a lot of stuff that is being poured out there. All right. So once again, guys, that's what's going on right now. And, uh, I'm a type of dude that I love, uh, fish, you know, it's protein is healthy, but, uh, it seems like w with, uh, all the stuff that's being dumped into, give me a second here, guys, give me a second. All right, so this was uh, so this is also December eight. So this information also came out today. Hold on, give me a second here, guys. Wait a minute. Wait a minute. I'm gonna have to zoom this in. So this was also posted today, December uh, December eight. It says December 8th. So this article must be from 
and one of those foreign countries. So U.S. shocker, thousands of Manhattan dead fish washed up on the beach in Texas. Low oxygen taking out fishes, claim experts. Well, you guys already know there's that oil spill going on out there in the Gulf. The Gulf of Mexico. Yeah, there's something going on here, guys. Um, So give me a second. I don't want to get hit by copyright with this advertisement going on. Shallow waters warm more quickly than deeper. So if a... Let me just skip that one. Let me just go down here. All right, so. This one's old, but for some reason, there's a date up here that I'm looking at right now. Friday, December 8, 2023. But this news here is old. I guess uh, I guess when you click on a website, it shows the date. OK, so I'm not going to read that Texas stuff. That's that's old. Uh, that's some old uh, news way back. Um, so once again, guys, uh, we are seeing something happening in Japan. Major events. They're calling it a mystery. A mystery going on out there. What's going on here? It's a mystery. It's a mystery. Yeah. Well, I guess uh, people forgot uh, that you know, something happened back in August. It's common sense. Tons of radioactive stuff was dumped into that area. But it's still a mystery. All right, guys. Thank you so much for watching. Please share this video. Again, like I said, uh, I do believe this is the tip of the iceberg. Um, again, just... It's common sense. When you dump stuff like this in the water, well, you're going to think everything's going to be fine with the fish and all that. It's going to be something. Either some of these fish is going to pop up with 20 eyes or I don't know, it's just looking weird. And I mean, again, guys, this is <sighs> dumping that stuff in the water. <laughs> Man. And then they say that we are the one that's causing the uh, CL. I M A T E change uh, because we drive too much vehicles. We driving too much cars, too much uh, exhaust being released and this and that, but they get the free pass. They could dump whatever they want and in into the ocean. Anyway, guys, thank you so much for watching. Once again, for those of you that want to give your life to Christ, you can email me. My email is in the description box. Me and my wife are here to help many and to lead many to the righteous path. And that's the path of our Lord and Savior, Jesus Christ. For those of you that want to send us letters or prayer requests, you can send it to me, Luis Santiago, or my wife, Jessica Santiago, at 3432 U.S. Highway 19, number 2, Holiday, Florida, 34691. Once again, guys, $1 a month Patreon. We get you access to our live stream every Sunday. We talk about things that we cannot talk about on the platform. Also, I posted videos today. Those links will be in the comments box. Anyway, guys, thank you so much for watching. God bless you all. Put your faith and trust in Jesus Christ, for he's the only way, the truth, and the life. No one gets to the Father but through Jesus. Thank you so much for watching. Till next time later. Peace.